out of the way hi um i do want to move on to my wardrobe because this is what we have to tackle <sighs> and it's done so the lashes just look like this <laughs> is that the question you asked me Little bad Ooh. bitch, what you mad for? Niggas yes. getting money, what you it's mad, what you mad for? Black boy fly, what you mad for? Highly underrated, that's life, what you mad for? No job, just vibes. Yeah, this is all my stuff right now. Taking up the half of the living room. I'm a late king, what you mad for? Never late these, little nigga, what you mad for? Oh my gosh. 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 Oh my Hi everyone, good morning everyone and welcome back to my vlog channel. So today is going to be a busy day, I'll tell you that for free. My head looks like this because guys, I really haven't been bothering with my appearance. Yesterday I was inside clips here, um, I went out with my friends because me and all my six month friends got together because it was one of, my one, of my 19th, one of my friends 19th birthdays and just kind of like a so long, farewell. We went to Las Iguanas for that but today I am... There's a last to do. There's a last to do. We gonna sit down and talk about it because there's a last to do. Today. The protocol for today is Tuesday the 15th. Ugh. It's Tuesday the 15th of September. I was about to say January. Definitely the ninth month of the year. Um, basically, I've got quite a lot to do today. This morning, it's been kind of a great morning. Jumped on prayer line and was able to listen to a message um, and then just kind of reply to some comments um, from my last few videos because I do like to keep on top of like replying to comments and stuff if you didn't know vlog channel and main channel have been doing that a lot of you guys have been enjoying the consistency which makes me happy because there's a lot more consistency coming um but i do need to now it's almost one o'clock now i need to go to the post office because i need to collect my shein order to show you guys in this haul in this haul in this vlog my shein stuff because i actually have filmed a haul i've edited that and that sunday's video um to go up i've also filmed wednesday's video so when you're watching this today's video also needs editing as well so i need to do that at some point today the first thing i need to do is go collect my shein order um because it's literally been in the post office for like about two weeks now since the fifth and it's now the 15th so yeah i actually need to go and collect that before they probably send it back um i need to actually pack all of this stuff guys so this is just some of my stuff this is like the stuff from my tracksuit haul this is the stuff from the haul that you guys will see on sunday um and i need to just get a head start that is all my clothes that was actually in a suitcase because guys if you didn't know i was actually supposed to go on holiday me abigail topria and teta you guys have all met them they're my great friends and we were supposed to go to cyprus we were going to go from i believe this 6th to the 10th but then it came down to it we said this is not wise for us to go on holiday in the midst of uni preparations and cash loss and cash loss so we cancelled the trip um and this was just some of the clothes that i had packed to go on holiday with and i actually didn't buy anything for the holiday because guys the amount of clothes that i've bought and i still haven't worn yet so yeah today i need to start packing i need to get out of suitcase i also i'm gonna plan to actually clean my shoes the weather is absolutely gorgeous out i've just closed the window because somebody was doing it again bob the builder i'm actually going to use today just to kind of get stuff done i do need to just head to the post office like asap or else i'll actually just not do that and i actually need to just sort a few things out with my tenancy um i'm literally just on the last ends of that like my accommodation is ready to move in i just need to do my online check-in oh also this morning i also managed to enroll um at my university so i do need to actually take a picture for my student card which i'm not going to do today because because I don't look cute but a day I think maybe Thursday um, I'm gonna take a proper picture because that's gonna be on my student card for the rest of the year so I need to sort that out as well um, also there's just loads of little bits and bobs that I need to do but I know they'll consume they'll take up time out of my day so I need to do the thing that I've been dreading the most first is go to the post office because it's like it's like a 15 minute walk from my house and it's just like really out the way and oh, just wa just want to show you guys quickly my mom bought me some socks really really random you lot these socks here yeah, i've been needing to pick up these socks for the longest time they're like the ones that go like this i don't know if you could like i don't know if that makes sense but basically they're like the ones that you can wear with like slip-on shoes or vans which i have like about five pair of like the slip-on vans yet i still don't like have these socks i'm glad my mom bought them they're the calvin klein ones and they were only four pounds from tk maxx and then also she picked myself she picked me up some black night socks because i've been literally looking everywhere for these and these are 5.99 i've got them in white and i just wanted them in black as well because you can never have enough white nike socks it's gonna be a great day um we're gonna start packing because also 
because I don't think I've actually mentioned I am going to be moving on on Thursday now I was supposed to go on Sunday but again I wasn't able I didn't manage to wrap up like the rest of my tenancy enough um, I'm going to do my ch online check-in and stuff like that because with COVID they're doing like all the COVID safety precautions and measures and stuff so I'll be vlogging that on thursday um so yeah get excited for that um so yeah i have two days i need to basically pack up all my stuff all my homework stuff let me show you guys all my homework stuff right now downstairs because it is ridiculous but my room is like it's, it's it's almost as if i'm like not moving anywhere and i'm just like staying you know but yeah let me show you my stuff this is what the living room currently looks like it's well, um, it was an organised mess the last time you saw it, but basically my mum's actually taken out, like, all the boxes and stuff and, like, put all the cups and stuff. I think she put popped them away, but she, like, sellotaped them and, like, this is another box and she's put labels on them somewhere, I think. Um, so, yeah, this is all my stuff right now, taking up pretty much half the living room, which is great. Um, but, yeah situation i do need to actually head to the post office like literally now because i think they actually close at like three four um but the weather is absolutely like i actually forget that it's like autumn winter i'm oh actually hot and i'm in literally all black guys imagine i've just walked all the way here and it's flipping closed our post office closes at 12 o'clock nah i'm annoyed i'm actually annoyed hi oh my gosh don't watch my hair i've put my afro back out which i have not done in literally so 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 long but the product build up is just it's it's immensely shocking um as you guys can have as you guys would have known or seen by the previous clip guys i went to the post office and it was closed what post office closes at two not even 2 p.m 12 p.m please but i do want to show you guys quickly what has come in the post is literally my um i believe it should be my pencil case there's no other orders that i believe i'm waiting for at the moment besides i think this is it actually um so yeah my pencil case is this this is actually quite cute um and i thought it would take a lot longer to come but it came a lot lot sooner i literally need to rush to go to town but it's wow it is small it's small but it's nice and it's quaint and it's cute <clears throat> so this is my pencil case if it will focus there we go it's like this white and black grid detailing with the pastel pink running through it if you've seen my back to school supplies haul um you guys would know i'm doing like a black and pastel theme and it's just literally got a gray interior which is really cute and it's got dividers which i will pop all my stuff in um and yeah that's just my pencil case i am very happy with that um and i can't wait to actually fill that up with all types of goodies but i am going to town i'm going to run some errands with sandra i'm actually going to pick up one of my free wraps which i have collected so over some time and yeah i'll see you guys all next next time catch me in the next clip guys, <laughs> guys after two weeks i've finally gone and picked up my shein order it's in like this really random i say random it's in like this really like just plain packaging okay, so it is now the next day this top is really, really awkward guys i am kind of wearing a graphic tee which has got water on it from when i put water in my hair this morning but i'm actually rocking my fro today um i feel like my hair has actually grown is it just me or maybe it's just gone thicker but like it's definitely hmm don't mind my appearance at this point in time i don't give a heck it's actually no job just vibes like guys so i'm officially officially unemployed my last shift was actually two saturdays ago i didn't even know it was my last shift and then my manager told me and i was like right and because i was working from home she came and collected my um computer and stuff i was working on but let me just close the windows it is now the next day it's wednesday the 16th of september i go tomorrow to move in all my stuff so today is the day that i'll actually get all my you know organization done hopefully this morning i was actually able to edit wednesday's video which would be up by now which is my back to school supplies haul I'm, I'm literally in the middle of uploading that now then the plan is to vlog today which i am currently doing also i just want to show you guys a couple of parcels that i have actually come in the post i finally went and collected my parcel that i was supposed to get yesterday but apparently 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 the um royal mail office is closed at 12 now because of corona so i went there this morning to go collect my parcel and then i'm going to eat some lunch because i need to make myself some lunch then i'm going to actually pack that is the plan yes show you guys what i've picked up the first thing i want to show you guys is basically one of my friends actually has started a lash business um called nl boutique quote me i'm so sorry if i'm saying that wrong but it's my friend natalia has 
she has started her own business in lashes so guys yeah she kindly actually sent me some lashes over just to kind of rock, wear and rock now i don't wear lashes but i will be promoting guys support black owned businesses support small businesses and that's what we finna do 2020 um so the lashes just look like this so pretty like look at the little packaging i'm not a lashes babe oh my gosh it even comes with a spoolie which i have been needing a spoolie for literally over a year and a half i always go into boots and just kind of jack their spoolies but yeah that'll be for my brows when i get them done this is just reminding me i need to book my brow appointment before i leave um but yeah basically these are the lashes absolutely gorgeous i'll leave all her links down below i'll leave her instagram down below her website how you can purchase them um and they don't they don't so i love what you're doing natalia keep up the good work and make sure you go and get yours now i want to now i want to show y'all the package that i have been meaning to show you guys for such a long time now um which is my she in order this is the only order that i'm actually waiting on oh my gosh oh my gosh ah! okay cool about four weeks to come but it's fine it's cool um the first thing that i got which has just fallen out completely is this little pom-pom um key ring um because i actually want my keys when i collect my keys tomorrow i want my keys to look cute i want it to look nice i want it to look you know not bare so i got this little pom-pom key ring it has a little leaf on it i don't know if you can see it's very cute but my aesthetic anyways so that's why i picked up and these small small things were like two pound oh my gosh <laughs> So, y'all know already that your girl likes money and she's all about her bag. So, I got myself this this keychain and it's just literally dollar, it's like a dollar cash, hundred dollar bills. Um, and again, these are like two pounds or something like that. I, it was late at night and I just said, you know what, why flipping not? I only got myself one phone case. Oh my gosh. Okay, so the next thing I picked up was this phone case. You guys know I love traveling. I am a travel babe. If I had the money, I would literally just want to be one of them YouTubers that get, get paid to travel. Um, so... I picked myself up a travel iPhone case um, and it's like a little ticket. Oh, this is nice. Oh, this is so nice. And I feel like it's just different to like the normal basic clear phone case. I'm definitely going to buy some more when I get paid on Friday. And it just has a ticket to New York, which <laughs> I've actually been to, <laughs> period. If you haven't gone and watched my travel vlogs, go and watch all my travel vlogs. I'm really proud of them and it just takes me back. So yeah, I went to New York and I've actually been to Paris as well. That's where my phone got stolen last year. This time last year, actually. Ha 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 ha. I actually love this. This is so cute. I feel like this is going to be like my new little phone case. It's not the most protective, but it does the job. Um, the next thing I actually picked up was this mini handbag. Now, I've been seeing a whole lot of YouTubers buy the Jacumas, Jacumus, Jack Jacumus. The most expensive, littlest handbags, and they are cost like about four, five hundred pounds. I think even more than that. And they're like this big. Um, so. I took myself to Shein and I said, we don't have Jacquemus, Jacquemus um, money, but we definitely got Shein money. And they basically do like a really, really good replica of them. Obviously without the Jacquemus um, little logo, but oh my gosh. Oh my God. I guess basically this like pastel blue. It's coming up very, very light on camera. Okay, now it's true to color. That is the color it is. It's like this kind of croc um, design print and it's absolutely, I really, really like it. I think the blue is such a nice color. And it actually comes with a long strap, which I will be rocking. This was like 10 99 and they do it in all the different colours. I actually wanted to get it in white initially, but then I saw the blue, I was like, nah. Nah, 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 nah. Here we go. So I picked it up in the little blue colour and it's like this little blue. This is gorgeous. I need to definitely get it in pink because I've got a hoodie that's pink and it's like... Ah, oh, oh my gosh. I need more bags. I think that's actually it. Yeah, I really... I am a bag person. Like, bags actually make a fit. Okay, no wonder this was 5 99 Right, so this is the bag. It's a white kind of... Um, it's like a little handbag. It's not the biggest, but it's big enough. Um, and it was 5 99 and it's very, very small. Wow. Wow, okay, very, very small. Wow, Shein expectation versus reality for real so it's like this bucket square style okay so it's not too bad i think you just got to fill it up with stuff um to make it have some shape because this is what it looks like so it's basically this again kind of basic croc style bag cream color um it looks slightly bigger on camera but it's fine it's fine we can, we can make do don't know what the string is for oh right you can loop it through because there's holes on, on the side which i probably won't be using but i think We'll make it work. We'll make it. We'll make it work. I think this is my second white bag I own. I don't actually own completely white bags, but I'm definitely, definitely picking this up in the white, the purple, and I think the pink. Yes. But yeah, bags. 
the last thing I picked up, which I'm actually the most excited about, is basically this like vintage style um, little shoulder bag. Uh, I, I have really been getting into these like type of shoulder bags. I have my black one, which I wear literally so religiously um, from Pretty Little Thing. And I saw this one. Oh, there we go. And I saw this one and it was just like really, really, I don't know. I really, really liked it. I like the browns and the kind of like the cool camel toned colors. And I actually have like a vest that is this color from Zara. And I think it will look quite nice, quite dope with it. But yeah, this is actually quite huge. It kind of reminds me of like my mom's kind of, how my mom used to dress, like this pattern, like honestly. But yeah, this is literally just the bag. So cute. Um, and worn correct, this will look lame. But yeah, that is literally everything I picked up from Shein, that's another mess that I made. Um, Shein is decent. My next order, I'm definitely gonna pick up maybe some graphic tees, but I probably will do that now when I get to Nottingham. But yes, I need to sort out so many things. I've, I literally need to sort out so many things in the space of like four or five days. Today is literally just my priority because the weather is absolutely gorgeous out. It's like a really nice sunny day. The weather's actually been really nice all week actually. Hello, there we go. So today I'm gonna pack, I need to clean my shoes. So I need to actually just clean all my shoes and leave it outside in my garden to dry. Um, and then, yeah, I actually wanna get back into doing the rice water challenge. Um, my edges have really, 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 really grown. I can tell where like, cause I know Nella Rose says that wigs actually grow her edges and her hair. And I would say, hmm, it kind of has. I'm not gonna lie, it really does have, like I do like the, length of my hair but it's at that awkward phase where it's like i can kind of slick it but then it does take a quite a lot of effort to slick it um so yeah for now i just want to kind of leave it out i might start jumping back onto the rice water challenge because it really softened my hair and my hair's kind of going back to that like hard phase again and i don't like that um but yeah this is your favorite youtuber also I've got a spot is just appearing here where my skin was going so clear like my skin goes through phases where it's like so clear for like about two weeks and then just a spot just randomly appears but anywho I'm gonna go make some lunch and then I'll probably catch up with you guys when I'm actually doing something. And this is my lunch. I'm literally about to come and catch up on EastEnders. My favorite show is back. I'm actually, guys, you lot know when it like this be my program. I'm so happy that it's back. Um, and for lunch, I've literally got some rice and stew and some coleslaw. Love, love, love it. This, this is just what I'm gonna miss like home cooked food and comfort. Ah! Oh. Two hours later. All right. Let's go get this. Oh, it's a bit dark. Oh my gosh, it's very dark. What the hell? All right. It is super dark. Oh. Right. Let's go get the suitcase. Oh god. All right. Oh, perfect. All right, guys. Oh. This is going to be my main suitcase. The time is currently Guys, it is literally five, almost five actually. I've um, just gone past quarter past. Um, basically, after the last clip you saw, I basically ate, catched up on EastEnders, and napped. So we're gonna get we're gonna get into it. I mean, there's still daylight outside, but it looks dark in my room for some reason. But I'm literally using this huge suitcase, um, which if you watched the, the New York vlogs, you would have seen. And I'm gonna get to packing. Cool. All right. Cool. Let's get into it. Kind of excited. Um, I don't know why. I feel like I'm going on holiday, like a really long holiday. This is all the stuff that I literally just chucked into this suitcase, which is a brand new suitcase that I took to Amsterdam with me. Um, this is all the haul stuff that I literally just chucked in there. So this is all brand new clothes. That is all my tracksuits there. This is the open suitcase. I don't know if you can tell how big it actually is on camera or if it's coming up on camera, but let me even switch off the lights now. Um, but yeah, this is exactly what we're dealing with right now. I'm going to get into packing um, and just kind of pick yeah maybe i should switch the lights on because it's really dark in my room um but yeah i'm gonna just get into packing now start with my clothes um start with oh this is so heavy it's actually heavier than it looks i'm gonna start with my wardrobe and then go into my chest of drawers because everything on that bottom drawer i'm not taking with me that bottom drawer is just home clothes and pajamas in here most of the stuff in here is actually can you tell i just gave up at a point in time like my like chest of drawers are just completely broken but yeah i just need to go through and sort all of this out um so yeah fun times i'm gonna do that and then i'm gonna put you guys on a time lapse so <sighs> enjoy the time lapse so i am watching some youtube i'm gonna be catching up on some youtube because i haven't watched youtube like in like four or five days so i'm gonna catch up on that and pack enjoy the time lapse <laughs> Bad 
bad bitch, what you mad for? Niggas getting money, what you mad, what you mad for? Black ball fly, what you mad for? Highly underrated, that's life, what you mad for? Mama dead broke, what you mad for? Guys, can you just like look at this please? I really have a texture like literal obsession. I've got one, these are all brand new. One, two, three, four, and five. I actually have like this one as well, but I don't think I'm gonna be taking it with me. Um yeah. Checker shirts, I absolutely love them. They're just such they're just such good like throw-ons and pops of colour. But anyways, let me get back to let me get to back to packing. For daddy the young nigga, tell me what you meant for. I'm a late king, what you mad for? Never late, please, real nigga, what you mad for? I'm um, skinny young nigga, young guy, but to pull up in a brand new whip Niggas hit a real long guy, so I give it that brand new flip hey, Why they criticize my way, should I give him that brand new drip? Tell them niggas catch me outside, get a taste of my brand new tins way Refrain, her legend to waste it in time Niggas working on that fire, so I criticize Sounding like a Richard Pryor, damn, are you mortified? Niggas running Bella Ring just to live a lie Slate to the mess and the me's and the melodies That's all I ever need, you can see the plot How the hell I'm underrated, but she give me top And a drug top and a rental, chicken nigga mental ah. Lil' bad bitch, what you mad for? Niggas getting money, what you mad, what you mad for? Black ball fly, what you mad for? Highly underrated, that's life, what you mad for? Mama dad broke, what you mad for? Daddy the young nigga, tell me what you mad for? I'm a late king, what you mad for? Never late... Right guys, so this is all my graphic tees that I've limited it all down to. They are all literally brand new. It doesn't actually look like a lot, but I promise you there are a lot in there. Um, but that is just the first kind of drawer that I've pulled out. All of these stuff are literally just going to be staying. Um, or I'm probably maybe going to depop them, we'll see. But now I do want to move on to my wardrobe. You're probably thinking, Nana, why do you want to do that top door? That top door is just in underwear, like bras and stuff. Um, so I do actually want to move on to my... Let me just move this one out of the way. Hi. Um, I do want to move on to my wardrobe because this is what we have to tackle. Um, all my shoes are going to be going to a completely different um, suitcase. But my clothes, guys. My jackets, guys. Oh my gosh. I still need to wear this jersey. I will definitely be wearing this. Um, I just need to get the right trainers for them. But this is so fly. I absolutely love this jersey. He's real nigga, what you mad for? Ah. Little bad bitch, what you mad for? Niggas getting money, what you mad, what you mad for? Black poor fly, what you mad for? Highly underrated, that's life, what you mad for? Mama dead broke, what you mad for? Daddy the young nigga, tell me what you mad for? I'm a late king, what you mad for? Never late, please, real nigga, what you mad for? I'm um, skinny young nigga, young guy, but I pull up in ah, This is my wardrobe. Yep, these are my shoes. <laughs> Those are my heels. Trainers are all literally scattered down there. Um, sorry, the lighting's not the best, and this is my jackets, and I haven't even gotten onto my trousers yet. Fun, let's do this. Bless my mum, she literally just came upstairs and dropped me some snacks, and I've got a, a lemonade that I'm going to be sipping on as well. This is the current situation, we're going to get to it. Um, obviously not going to be taking all of this, but... Yeah, I think, I think this will actually will all fit in one suitcase. My plan was to just bring one suitcase full of clothes, um, have a little suitcase just for like extra little bits of clothes, and then another suitcase for shoes. But then I forgot, I've actually got bags now upstairs. Upstairs? Up there. Oh, why do I have so many? Why do I have so much stuff? Like, why? Guys, it's now 5.30. I've completely filled up this suitcase. So this suitcase is full of just going out tops, rib tops. Um, I think this is jump dresses and jumpers and that some trousers um jeans trousers 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 some smart clothes a lot of my church stuff is in here as well um i've realized i actually don't have a lot of denim jeans i literally have two pairs that i'm taking up there with me and i'm just gonna buy the rest up there because guys quarantine let's just say that at the least um there's two of my jackets there and then the rest is all there but this suitcase is completely done and ready to go downstairs i'm now going to fold this suitcase up i might actually keep my tracksuits in the mania devoir um bag and then fill this this bag up with like my underwear my bras my just bags and just random stuff like that um and then just keep the mania devoir bag full of just all my tracksuits so i just know it's all in one place but yeah i'm kind of on the fence of bringing this skirt um, if you watch my haul during quarantine, I bought this skirt. It's like a corduroy misguided skirt. Um, and I feel like it's very autumnal, but I'm just kind of on the fence of uh, will I wear it or not to lectures. Um, but yeah, this is the current update. I shall be back here in about an hour's time. Guys, can we deep this dress, please? This dress is so nice. I've li I've had this dress for like about, about three years now. It is so nice. It's like V-neck plunge. It's silk. It is gorgeous. But why am I wearing this too, please? Because nowhere's going to be open if we're going back into lockdown. Oh my...
brand new whip. Yeah, niggas hit a red long guy, so I give it that brand new flip. Yeah. Wait, why they criticize my way? Should I give it them brand new drip? Hey, tell the niggas catch me outside, get a taste of my brand new tins. Wait, reframe. Tell me that you never ride a wave though. Trap queen, so she fucking with the Quavos. Magazine covers, rolling for the smoke host. And my enemies throwing shots to the prince. Mama told me never let him win. Mama told me never let him win. Ay, I'ma catch a vibe even when I'm on E. I'ma catch a vibe every day of the week. Ay, little bad bitch, what you mad for? Niggas getting money, what you mad, what you mad for? Black boy fly, what you mad for? Highly underrated, that's life, what you mad for? Mama dad broke, what you mad for? Daddy the young nigga, tell me what you mad for? I'm a late king, what you mad for? Never late peace, real nigga, what you mad for? Ah. Little bad bitch, what you mad for? Niggas getting money, what you mad, what you mad for? Black boy fly, what you mad for? Highly underrated, that's life, what you mad for? Mama dad broke, what you mad for? Daddy the young nigga, tell me what you mad for? I'm a late king, what you mad for? Never late. Okay. So, um, I have packed all my underwear and socks and whatnot. I'm not really gonna give you a close up of that because it's all like brand new underwear and stuff like that. Um, but now, that's some pajamas, some belts. I'm now about to, now I'm about to tackle all my stuff up here. Some of this is like accessories and stuff, bags, scarves. I'm gonna dump them all in here. This is literally just gonna be like my accessories, kind of bag, suitcase thing. So yeah, enjoy me trying to struggle whilst I get this down. He's real nigga, what you mad for? Um, skinny young nigga, young guy, but I pull up in a brand new whip. Yeah, niggas hit a red long guy, so I give it that brand new flip. Wait, why they criticize my way? Should I give it them brand new drip? Hey, tell the niggas catch me outside, get a taste of my brand new tins. Wait, reframe. This is too much. Guys, I have stupid amounts of stuff. Bear in mind my room is tiny, like I don't, oh, there we go. I don't get how all of this fits in my room, but we're gonna do some selection, see what I want, dump into this bag, and we'll be done for that top bit. Oh my gosh, this is, oh, this is really sad. This is the current state. So I'm gonna try and attempt to close this suitcase. Um, and you guys are gonna watch me try and close this suitcase. It is literally ram packed. I've managed to actually fill up this suitcase, which is good and ready to go downstairs. Full of like underwear and stuff like that. I have left some for the remaining days that I'm here. But, uh, uh, uh -huh. pull it towards me. This is not a one man job, but it's, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. I trust my 45 pound um suitcase that i bought from primark love that oh my gosh this is not going to close uh, i've never had to actually do this before having to actually stand on my suitcase this side is fine it's this side where all my bags are and thick winter jumpers for some reason oh my she's sweating all right guys we're getting somewhere we are uh, get it somewhere guys i think i've done it <laughs> and it's done yes okay cool now i need to get down um but yeah guys that is my first suitcase completely full to the brim second suitcase completely full don't mind my bin it is a complete mess and let's move on to our next suitcase when your suitcase is so heavy oh god guys there was no way i was taking that that's it myself so we've got the boys doing that on to the next suitcase let's go why do i have so much stuff okay so 45 minutes later this bag is literally just full of shoes a one jacket a bag scarves and that and hats um and then here are my heels i'm gonna just pop them in like a little bag i also have packed look guys if you are like have seen this whole video i still haven't worn these trainers you know but i probably will get aware of them in uni um i also have two pairs of trainers in there also that i just need to do some promo for on my instagram before i pack them away but these are just like my heels and kind of like church more classier shoes i need to take with me and a few sliders um and then i think i need to actually move on to my oh my stuff stuff so like 
yeah all of this like important documents this is not even gonna open like technology and gadgety stuff so i need to actually move on to this bit here which the only things i'm probably going to be taking from here realistically are my sprays and my jewelry i'm not actually taking these like clear little things i'm definitely not taking probably like my eyelash color and like my this this i'll probably throw it because that's quite disgusting um and i will not be taking any of this because i don't wear makeup um and any makeup that i do buy hopefully by then i will be a youtuber enough to rotate for it to get sent to me or just not wear it um but yeah i think i'll i think two more suitcases and i'll be done two more suitcases and a, like a, a a shopping bag i think i'll be pretty much done we'll see how that goes but yeah i think this uh, i mean <laughs> you guys i'm not actually going until the 21st of september so i'm doing two trips i'm going tomorrow which will fit in most of my, my homeware stuff and then on the 21st i want to be taking more of like my clothes in that um so yeah also i actually need to break this piggy bank um i need to do this in this vlog because i want to go to the bank and cash this all in i've had this piggy bank for about a year now i don't know how much money is in there and i recall definitely putting in some notes in there maybe but i'm sure it's pretty much just pennies and whatnot but let's see how much this probably counts up to guys just currently watching um jordan's vlog when she went to mykonos with her boyfriend um just finished up there's actually quite a lot of bags i want to show you guys that i'm actually leaving um i don't know if i actually want to take my po polaroid camera like this takes up so much space but i feel like it'll be really nice on the shelf i'll leave that there just as a just in case but guys there is again lots of bags that i'm not taking this bag i got like two years ago still brand new as you can see the tag and i've never worn it but it's fine i'll just leave it here for when i visit oh there we go I can't believe I just did that with one hand. Um, but yeah, coming to actually just... I've put all my... The rest of my shoes in just this little bag here. Ready to take downstairs, which is just kind of all my... Kind of going out, trainer shoes. But I don't know if i'll take all of them i have still haven't decided i'm literally breaking a sweat um because that last case was so heavy but this is the rest of the wardrobe so many hangers gone um these are just some clothes that i actually brand new i never wore um i'm still deciding on taking a few of the jackets here those are all like the bombs that i'm not taking with me it's just sad it's like an end of an era okay right guys so update time they've completely gone through all these drawers and kind of gone through all the things that i need to take um there's still some few things that obviously i need just for the next few days but yes i've packed my bibles some of my retainer stuff which i actually need to get back into wearing my retainer again at night some books this is my jewelry in this little zoella bag who remembers zoella like when she was at this phase um i've got some all of this has got my gadgets in my little ted baker wash bag some of my phone stuff um a camera which i bought when i went to where did i go amsterdam never used it so i'm going to take it to uni with me um in here's got my hair stuff i just used like a little empty neck box and this is just the rest of the hair stuff that i feel like it still has product in it and i can take with me my straighteners some face masks um some sephora face masks that i got in paris um and just like random stuff like this and then yeah so i've done completely my windowsill i literally just need to come and break this right now done completely up there so that's done I've also gone through all of these. This is all the makeup that I'm leaving. I'm probably going to give it to my mum. Um, I'll be taking these, but obviously closer to the time. Um, this is just literally my oil and roll on i'll be using for the next what five days um and then all of this again is staying this plant all of this acrylic storage is staying um literally all of this is staying pretty much um drawers are looking so empty don't mind this bit oh okay that just happened great yep thanks well done nana um drawers are completely empty these are stuff that again i'm just keeping here and plus i do want clothes here just when i do come and visit um and this is all my home clothes which i'm definitely keeping here um as well but that is pretty much it i need to go downstairs i'll, I'll sort out my jackets that's one of the last things i need to sort out wardrobe is completely done as well but yeah guys what can i say i've never looked this bad on youtube before wow <laughs> guys the one thing i will say about going through all my old makeup is looking at all these like lip glosses like can you believe this is like 2016 Anna. i used to have stuff like hold on let me prop you up so deep i used to wear makeup like this like lip glosses like this um hold on i found this little stick this is the this is the revlon revlon color burst stick can you imagine i used to wear this look at that oh my gosh and like guys i used to i used to spend so much money on makeup that i never actually wore this bright red i would never wear something like that today literally give me some lip gloss and i'm gonna keep it stepping 
and honestly look at this this i'll tell you i'll show you guys this was actually my first ever mascara it's an mua this is still the first ever one that i got um and it's literally just looks like that MUA was literally the plug back in the day. Now they want to move more bougie. But this is literally just full of mascaras. Because literally that's all that I wear. So I was going through all my like glosses. And like guys I have so many lip liners. And ask me do I even ever lip line my lips? What even is this? Okay guys so I am finally going to smash this. Um, not want to show you the rest of my face. Because I don't look the greatest right now. Um, I pretty much finished everything in my room. I literally just need to do underneath my bed. Which I will do on Friday and then I'm just gonna go downstairs and sort out a few things but I'm finally gonna open this I don't have a hammer so I'll just have to get it away all right I'm just gonna pour it all out um let me even do that here ready three two one Oh, 50p. Oh, and that is it completely empty. Wow. That is my piggy bank of about a year and a bit. Two, guys, £2.85p. All of that is £2.84p. I'm actually, guys, I'm actually like disappointed in myself. This is a mockery. Hi. So, basically, guys, and it's gone dark again. I am literally on my way downstairs because I've just finished eating, I've showered and I feel fresh. Um, I'm in my bonnet and my literal pyjamas, as you can see. Um, and I am coming to tape up all of this stuff. I need to tape up this box, this box, this box, that box which I opened earlier. Um, I just need to kind of rearrange all of it because we go tomorrow. Time is currently 10. 19 um, i think it's actually quite early like i'm not tired but i mean i'm definitely gonna go to sleep soon our check-in slot for tomorrow is 12 um and it's about two and a half hour journey from where i live so we need to leave latest by nine or maybe even eight my mom said only because of traffic and stuff and rush hour so i'm gonna get this all done and hopefully be, be asleep by maybe midnight we'll see i've got some more monster munch with me and we're gonna do this um but yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and FaceTime my friend Natalie because she wanted to just speak um, whilst you do your FaceTime. Um, and yeah, enjoy the time lapse again. I feel like this vlog is literally just time lapses. Cue the time lapse. Bitch, what you mad for? Niggas getting money. Hey. Hmm? Is the pajamas you're taking to uni? <laughs> is that the question you ask me? So, guys, this is the ending product. I'm still on FaceTime to Natalie over there. She's just in bed. Um, but yeah, this is the end result. I've now added my clothes, 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 some stuff that I need to go in there, but I'm not opening that now. Um, some all of this is sorted now. They I've kind of wrapped them all up in this bubble wrap. Um, just like my mugs and stuff. And yeah, got some more stuff down there. Everything's just like stacked up on top of each other, like Tetris, but we getting somewhere. All of this hopefully should fit in the car tomorrow. If not, again, I will be doing two trips, so it's fine. But I'm so ready to go to bed now. Honestly, guys, it has been literally a day and a half. I'm literally ending this vlog here again. <laughs> Best YouTube in the world. But I hope you guys did enjoy. I need to go to bed now. It's like 11 o'clock and tomorrow is an early start. I will see you guys tomorrow with a brand new vlog. If you enjoyed, like, subscribe, all of that, all of that. I'll see you in my next one. Bye.